Hey guys, Mr. Verhost here, bringing you two gameplays today. The first gameplay is an NV4 deatomizer on the map terminal, and the second gameplay that you'll be watching is just me playing some Modern Warfare 3. Um, I've only ever played six hours of that game, and I thought, you know what, I got a nice, decent gameplay. It was like nine, uh, 39 kills in TDM just with my gun. So I thought, you know what, stuff, I'm going to post it, and yeah, hopefully you enjoy both the gameplays. Um, I wouldn't mind trying to get a Moab on M Dub 3, um, but I just need to get higher level and get some like like pro perks, and also I need to also get the ACR and other stuff. Sadly, because I had jump shot a lot in that game, it was quite funny when I was playing M Dub 3. <clears throat> Kids were saying like, "Why are you trying so hard? Stop tryharding. You think you're good and all this shit." And I was just sitting here to myself like, I didn't even know where I was running on the maps half the time. Like that six hours is like over years of playing that game like i've r r barely touched it and like i just jumped on yesterday playing all the older cods just to see what they were like and there was kids there with like 250,000 kills complaining that i'm jump shotting i was thinking like man go get a ps4 and upgrade bro <laughs> like this kid was still playing m 3 and sooking when when he gets killed by a player that's better than him like, it was quite funny man and like they were using like mp7s and shit and i'm like sitting here like come on bro i've just got this little scar out and I actually was using a subby at one stage, it was like called the PP90 or something. Man, it was good to go back to old gods, like, I was playing, um, a bit of Black Ops 2 as well. Uh, sadly, I could only get one lobby of Black Ops 2, uh, and it took half an hour. So, that sort of sucks to know that that game's dead in Australia. It was my favourite game. But yeah, like, let me know if you ever go back to older cods and have you, like, tried any recently. One thing I can say about Modern Warfare 3 is the connection is perfect. Like, I had no issue with connection at all um, playing Modern Warfare 3. I, I stopped playing Infant Warfare yesterday because of people were, like skipping five meters ahead and the bullets were like disappearing and on, on the people. And I just really couldn't be bothered like screwing around knowing it's the dedicated servers and the lag comp in the game just not connecting very well together and functioning, especially the netcode. The, like, I don't know what they did to it, man. Like, some days I feel like the game is the best, and then other days I feel like it's the beta where nothing registers. And, you know, I have clips of me playing in American lobbies just because it felt like it had a better connection, and, and I'm from Australia. So, I don't know if maybe it's like a rerouting issue when you're playing. Maybe they route you around to places that you shouldn't be going and bring you back, but didn't enjoy Infinite Warfare, so that's why I thought, you know what, fuck it, I'm going to post something different. But this is the Deatomizer, and now we're getting straight into some Modern Warfare 3. No audio, by the way, with the Modern Warfare 3 clips, because, well, I don't know. I had to do a little trick to even record with my Elgato on the uh, PS3. I had to, like, hold my button down for 10 seconds and shit. It was quite weird, so sadly you won't have the audio, but nevertheless you can still see the gameplay and just the general, you know consensus of what I was doing it's pretty cool like I was using the Zim 4 as well um, never really played on the old gen with the keyboard so it was good to try it out and I must say I really really enjoy playing keyboard and mouse on the boots on the ground Call of Duties it's a lot easier um, I'm sort of happy that when I got the Zim I had to get it on Infinite Warfare because uh, playing with a keyboard and mouse on Infinite Warfare was a really huge learning curve that I'm glad I had because now that I play it on the boots on the ground games, it's a lot more basic and less um, erratic movement, so it was a lot easier to adjust. And yeah, like the sensitivities and stuff, it was all pretty self-explanatory. I just set it to max, I had my curves, all that, and it just seemed to be really smooth and I really enjoyed it, to be honest. Um, I, what, what more can I say, really? Um, this map, I don't even know what this map was called, but I got stuck in this building here because they called in a helicopter. So it was getting a bit intense, but I do like the drop shotting in MW3 as well. There's no like sliding and dolphin diving. It's just like, you know, you hit the ground straight away when you drop shot. I thought that was really cool, but as you can see, like I just love jump shotting in this game. I, I, I just, I don't know what it is, man. My aim is just so good on this game though, boys. Like, I don't know if you've noticed, but... I just love playing this game, dude. Like, the aiming is nice. Everything feels so smooth. And, like, this is all peer-to-peer. -peer. There's no dedicated servers on this shit. So, um, when you play this game, you know, it's, a, like, peer-to-peer. -peer and, like, I pull host every now and again, obviously. Because I do have pretty decent internet when it comes to, like, speeds and open that type, which helps. So, I, sometimes I pull host. Um, but this was not a host game. This is just off-host um, someone else's connection. I think he was from Tasmania, to be honest in this game um so 
as you can see though, just real smooth and like the graphics obviously are a bit of a letdown. The graphics aren't good, but I do enjoy this COD and I don't know, man. I might even go back and play it again. Here I quadruple jump shot at that kid. Oh man, he. <laughs> that's what I mean by jump shot, man. Like I jump shot a lot and then. I don't know, like, like <laughs> people were complaining about it. I was like, is that normal? Did, does anyone else jump shot this much? When I had a scuff, I swear I still jump shot that much. I'm just saying. But, uh, yeah, supposed, supposedly that me jumping around like a banana is not normal. So, <laughs> anyway, I hope you, like, you've enjoyed the commentary and that. And uh, let me know if you even lasted to the Modern Warfare 3 section of the game. Um, just interested to see how long people actually stay on the channel or before they click off. Um, so just leave a comment, you know, what you think, what you'd like to see. I can't play Black Ops 2 because, sadly, no lobby. So what do you, what, would you like to see some Black Ops 1, MW3, maybe Modern Warfare 2, sniping I could try? I don't know, let me know. Um, maybe even do like a muck around 1v1 with my mates or something. Um, just because Infinite Warfare is a bit stale and, yeah, I, I, I don't know, man, I'd... Yeah, I'm up and down about it. I have enjoyed playing. I will be playing it tomorrow. Let letting you know that the double, uh, double keys uh, are tomorrow. So you will get double keys for every game. So I will be playing Infinite Warfare for that. Uh, but yeah, anyway, I'm just gonna let it play out, man. Um, sadly, like I said, no audio. But I'll try and get that fixed if I do bring another clip to you guys. Anyway, please like, sub, and share. Come as well. Come on, catch you later. Have a great day. Peace. I think it was like 39 and six gameplay wise. And yeah, Scarl. Suppressor, Red Dot, and Perks, I have no idea.